Most of our classes were in the evenings because we had a working population. We had very few day classes. Uh, we had afternoon and evening classes and very limited what you would call co-curricular or other kinds of activities. People drove in, they took their classes, and they basically drove out. We, there were very limited places to eat on campus. In fact, on the second floor of PC where we have our portrait of our presidents, those were all vending machines and other areas that were there, and primarily uh, we, we ate there. I think it's important to even think about what this area looked like because there was very little. It was basically a lot of undeveloped land. A lot of people came to the campus to bring their kids to fly kites, to skate, to do everything because this was just an, you know, a vacated uh, airport. But in terms of campus life, it was pretty much classes, focused on classes. And then we started off with an interesting method of having classes uh, four days a week. The other thing that was interesting, we started off with an interesting model because we had this, we were going to not have letter grades, we were going to have honors credit and credit and, and no credit. And that was the first model of how we started to grade. So a lot of experimentation, a lot of opportunities, those were some of the kinds of things that were there. And that's, I think, the part that's really exciting, the, the, the opportunity to be a part of something that's growing, that's new, that was not... Uh, bottled down in tradition within people saying, oh, you can't do that, you know. So I think that that has been a spirit that the university has maintained, even now, an ability to feel like we'll try, we'll try, and, you know, uh, be able to accomplish that.